Y'all already know what we doing. Y'all already know it's gonna be a cold fire day. What is up, everybody? How's it going? How's your day going, bro? I hope the vibes are right. I hope everything is going so well for every single one of y'all watching this. Today's video, bro, we are here at Catalyst. We about to pick up a couple, actually now we're only gonna pick up one stream, but they dropped a couple new ones. And so we're gonna be grabbing one. I don't know what I'm gonna walk out with, but hell yeah, y'all. Y'all better toke up, y'all better set up. Or if not, bro, y'all better, you better prepare yourselves, bro, because we're all gonna get the token. But we about to run in there right now, so I'll catch y'all real quick. We are now back. We got the good. And this was the hardest decision, y'all. This was the hardest decision to make because there is three new strains. There is Grapple Pie, which has been around. And then there's Mamba Mint. There's also Cinnamon Rolls, bro. Like, that was the hardest fucking choice, bro. So what I ended up with, because of Jordan, bro, just because of Jordan, so shout out to Jordan. We got the Mamba Mint by Green Dragon. Now I looked it up beforehand and I noticed that it was by Green Dragon. I was like, oh shit. I gotta cop another Green Dragon, bro. So this one says it's supposed to taste like waffle cones and packing peanuts. Interesting, interesting. And the Terps is 10.3%. This one is a cured resin. The THC is 86.5% with less than 2% CBD. And this was packaged on 4-10-2023. So this is some fresh, fresh, fresh stuff right here. You know, we about to go to my job real quick because I got to get to work. We about to open it. We about to take a hit. And then we're going to come back once again on my lunch break because I don't really got that much time right now. So I'll catch y'all. My bad, y'all. Hey, honestly, y'all, I think I'll be able to get this review done. Maybe. We got 20 minutes on the clock. So maybe we can get this little review done. So let's get this shit started. All right, y'all. I already told you the, the specifics. So y'all can go, you know, rewatch that if you like. But I'll tell you what it's supposed to taste like once again. Mamba mints, waffle cones, and packing peanuts with 10.3% terps. All right. So hell yeah. Let's crack this shit open, bro. I heard it's some exotic, man. I heard this is like an exotic shit. I mean, it kind of sounds exotic, bro. Mamba, bro. You hardly ever hear any mamba strains. I mean, there is some mamba strains out there, but I hardly don't even see them. So mamba mint sounds pretty fire. Not gonna lie. That shit's clear. This shit looks like um the Kush Company uh color because I've had the Kush Company from my girl and that one's pretty fucking gas I will say so I recommend that strain also if you ever see the Kush Company um the Kush Company OG bro that shit's fire that shit's too gas bro that shit sh that shit should be illegal man on oh, god same with Wolsey Wo that shit should be illegal whoa okay off the smell what we got right there we got some weedy punginess all right damn it smells pungent but like it has like a like a lime kind of smell though like a lime like it smells limey oh yeah like some green weed like it smells like some fresh dude what the fuck this one smells dank like this one's the definition of dank i'm not gonna lie I'm scared for this one. Mamba mints, bro. Mamba mentality. We gonna be good, man. We just gotta have that shit. Mamba mentality. That's it, man. Slap it on here. But yeah, off the smell, bro. It's green dragon, bro. This shit smells gassy. Straight cushy, straight gassy. This shit's insane. Whoa. Dry hit's kind of different. A little bit. Just a tad bit. I mean, obviously, it's gonna be a little bit different. But, dude, it just tastes gassy. It just tastes weedy and gassy. So, we gonna put it on 2.6 actually 2.4 to get a nice little flavor town rip so without further ado if y'all have not seshed yet i think we should just get this little hit going and for those that already toked i hope y'all feeling your best whatever y'all do when you're high bro i just hope y'all enjoying it seriously but hell yeah cheers Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Off that hit right there. It just tastes like some fresh ass bud. But this has the gas, like I said, I don't know if all these green dragon strains have the same um, gassiness note to it, but all the green dragon strains have this gassy note. But this one, bro, I think this is the killer one out of all of them. <laughs> it took that long for me to cough bro 
Wow. This shit, it, it tastes like weed. Fresh weed. It kind of tastes limey. Like, it, it's like limey and minty. I think that's what it, I think that's what it is, bro. Like, when it tastes fresh and clean, it has, like, that minty kind of taste. That makes a lot of sense, bro. So, yeah, it has a minty, weedy taste. But, like, it's kind of limey to me. It's, like, kind of lime. But, holy shit. I'm fucking with this. I'm fucking with it. I'm not going to say it's the craziest strain, but it's, like, fucking it, it's pungent like i mean you it, you hear me talking bro at least early you, a little bit you heard me talking man this shit had me like kind of trying not to cough so this shit's kind of potent man and i'm wondering how the cinnamon rolls would have tasted and i think i might pick that up sunday maybe if i'm really tempted enough if i'm that desperate bro i think i might grab the cinnamon rolls because that is pancakes mixed with runts I don't know what the fuck kind of concoction that would be, but Pancakes on its own, bro, is a fire strain. I fucking love that strain to death. I've only had that from Ursa Nova, and that shit was gas, bro. One of the best Ursa Nova carts I've had. Was it Nova? Yeah, the Ursa Nova. But hell yeah, let's take another rip, y'all. Shall we? Cheers. Yeah, it's like clean, fresh weed. But it tastes really fucking bomb. It's really good. I recommend this shit. I recommend this without a doubt, bro. This is a smacker. Certified slapper. <coughs> oh my god, I'm about to get baked as fuck. With my eyes closed, I feel that shit a lot more, man. And the oil is just super, super clean. So this is cured resin. Like I said, this isn't live resin. Mamba mints, y'all. Waffle cones and packing peanuts, bro. I don't, dude, these, these like descriptions don't make sense, man. I get it, it's gimmicky in a way. Some of them do actually make sense, but this one doesn't. I mean, maybe, maybe you can kind of say the packing peanuts. But I don't know about no damn waffle cone. I don't taste no waffles, bro. I mean, it's not supposed to taste like that, but. I'm just trying to see if I can make sense, or I don't know. What the fuck is Mamba Mints? Hold up. What is Mamba Mints exactly? What are the mix? What's the mix? Are they not gonna say it, bro? If they not, if they don't say it, bro, I mean it's cool. I get it, I get it, but um, I would hope so. It just only says the taste. It just only says the taste. Nothing about the strain. I don't know what the fuck Mamba Mints is. I mean, I've had KRD Mints. It kind of tastes similar like this. But this one's a lot better than Kara Demons. Kara Demons tasted like a regular cart, to be honest. You can maybe say that for this one, but nah, Green Dragon is gas, bro. You can't talk shit about Green Dragon, bro. This is the third one I've had. Gas. Or fourth. This is the third or fourth one I've had, maybe. But this shit's fucking solid. Let's take another one. Let's get fucking medicated. Cheers. I suck at my tricks, all right? Don't fucking judge. Let me say this though, with every coal fire cart you grab, bro, I mean, maybe not every, but the ones that I've been grabbing, bro, every time you French inhale, I mean, it, it might be all of them, dude. Every time you French inhale these coal fire carts, it just tastes like a fucking bowl. It smells like a bowl and it fucking tastes like a bowl after you fucking took a rip out of it. That's what the fuck this smells like. So it's like, it's pretty crazy how weedy these strains are. You don't even fucking realize it until you French inhale. To be honest, you get more of a taste and it's like more weed like it just tastes like fucking it's crazy it's crazy what coal fire does with these with these carts bro i give them mad props i ain't no brand ambassador i just love the brand bro i seriously dude i fucking i spend my hard-earned money on this shit all the time bro even when i feel like i shouldn't fucking spend it i, I say fuck it bro i'm drooling and shit but i say fuck it man because i want to try new shit every time i see something new bro i'm like god damn it why they gotta do me like that bro they gotta do me like this in the wrong time fucking but i'm like you know what you know what i'll throw my money i'll give you my money you know what it's okay i'll give you my money dude yeah this is a solid indica so yeah this is an indica strain you're gonna be feeling good you're gonna be feeling relaxed really mellow really chill maybe sleepy depending on how you feel it can enhance your um effects that you're already feeling from being sober you know this shit i would say it's a good i'm gonna give it i'm gonna give it a good nine out of ten or yeah 8.5 to nine it's actually nine 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 i give it a nine this one's solid this is a solid fucking car i'm not gonna lie it, it, it i, I could kind of see if someone could say it tastes kind of generic in a way but for me, that gassiness, 
And that smell of the aroma in here, nah, man, this shit's fucking, this shit's solid, bro. Green Dragon, don't sleep on them. If you haven't tried Green Dragon, you should try them, bro. They've been pretty good. Uh, Dragon Runs, fire. The franchise, fire. Uh, the recent one I just had, I don't remember what's the name. Fire as fuck. Literally, everything's been fire. Mamba Mints, fire. Dude, this shit smells really fucking bomb. I fucking love Coal Fire, y'all. Shout out to Coal Fire, bro, once again. I never, I've never even shouted out Coal Fire, but... I always talk good about them, and um, yeah, I always always recommend uh, Coal Fire to everybody because they're really solid, and I know they can be a little bit pricey, I know they can be a little bit pricey, but for me, they're priced pretty pretty average, so I can't complain whatsoever. My lips are chapped, dude, I'm dry as fuck all around, so if you made it to the end of this video, bro, I seriously do appreciate every single one of y'all, it really does mean the most like i'm just very thankful i'm always gonna be thankful as always y'all pulling up to the streams y'all pulling up to the lives like the premieres and shit like i'm very thankful bro and y'all liking dude y'all been going crazy bro with the streams and shit i'm just fucking thankful i'm just fucking thankful for everybody pulling up let's take a last little hit before i log off so hell yeah y'all let's take this last little toast cheers <laughs> I'm already baked, bro, and like I'm, I'm, I'm going to work, bro. So I can't, I get, I can't be too big. If y'all enjoyed this video, put a fucking W. Hope everyone has a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Peace.